It was scary knowing that athletes could go into Russia and just be arrested for being gay. Homosexual propaganda was illegal. After the 2014 Olympics in Sochi, I decided that I wanted to come out publicly. Every winter, my mom would bring me to the rink to go skating, and every winter, I hated it. The year I was turning 10, something kind of changed. As a birthday present, my mom signed me up for the group classes. So that's how I originally got my start in skating. I think in figure skating, there's sort of a stigma where if you're a figure skater, you're gay. And I got teased a lot at school. You know, it was hurtful. I wish that when I was younger, there was somebody who was close to me that I could have looked up to. When you are in the closet as a gay person, you kind of live with the secret. And I remember having the conversation with myself, like, I'm gonna live with this forever and I'm not gonna tell anybody. I didn't know what my family would think. I didn't know what my friends would think. And I felt like people would think that I was lying to them. I really fought knowing that I was gay for a long time. To pursue my dreams, I needed to move away from home if I was going to be skating at an elite level, and that took me to bigger cities. It opened my eyes to the world. I met a lot of gay people, and when I met other gay people, I started to realize that people liked who they were because they were funny and they were nice, and they worked hard, and being gay really had nothing to do with that. It was the quality of person they were. I think I was like 21. The first person I came out to was this guy that I was flirting with. I got a text message from him and it was like he was kind of flirting and I sent one back and I was kind of flirting and I was like, this is kind of gay. And then I was like, oh my God, I'm gay. I thought about like me being that young kid. You're 10 years old, you're gay, and you don't know anybody else who's gay, so you don't have anyone to kind of look up to. I owed it to those young kids growing up to say something for them, to make the journey easier for them. After the national championships in 2015, I decided that it was the right time. I think it just sets an example that, you know, no matter who you are or where you come from, especially in sports, you're respected for the hard work that you put in. And that's the most important thing. The people who came before me, they made it easier for me and they made being gay something that you didn't need to be ashamed of, something you didn't need to hide. They made it okay to be yourself. I'm Adam Rippon. I'm 27 years old and I'm a Team USA Olympic figure skater.